a lot of students do want to come to school, but they cannot come to school because of how far they have to walk and what they have to go through. I applaud, actually, the students um, stepping forward and saying we would really like um, to get on the buses. Mary Ellen Killenbeck says she and other district officials are on board for a policy adjustment after students demanded change at the school board meeting last week. The Syracuse City School District currently provides busing for middle school students who live over a mile and a half away and for high school students over two miles away. But students and teachers say that distance is too far, too dangerous, and too cold in the winter. He was walking back to his house and he lived about 1.6 miles away and then he got jumped. Um, he had a concussion because somebody beat him from behind. I saw one student this this year who had three teeth knocked out when he was jumped on his way home from school. Transportation Director Killenbeck says the district is researching and collaborating with Centro to figure out how to best move forward. The, uh, we're looking at addresses linked to schools and um, lowering thresholds to see exactly what the um, logistical and financial impact would be. And Ms. Suskovic says that she and her students here at Henninger High School will continue to work first for a short-term solution, then hopefully for a longer-term fix. Why am I here? I'm here to make a difference, and I want change. In Syracuse, I'm Danielle Gaiman, NCC News.